Hi, I'm Nathan Hikes, an agronomy field technician with Growmark FS. Today is May 2nd, and I'm in beautiful Hershey, Pennsylvania, on the grounds of the Milton Hershey School Farm, looking at some forage plots that Growmark has planted here of different species, but specifically I'm looking at the Timothy. Uh, this is the time of year where Timothy mites become apparent, so I'm scouting the Timothy here, and in this plot I am seeing a lot of rolled leaves that look like drought stress even though we've had adequate moisture and there's a little bit of purpling there so that's classic timothy mite symptoms over in this adjacent plot it's a little bit of a later maturing variety and it looks a lot more normal i don't have so many of those rolled leaves but over in this mid-range maturity variety i've definitely got the symptoms of some timothy mites and they are a yield robbing factor so they need to be remedied so the only thing labeled in this instance is going to be some 7 XLR. So I'm going to apply 7 at 2 to 3 pints per acre. And that's to be done once 25% of the tillers are affected, which is definitely the case here. Or if there's a historic problem in this field, it can be done uh, four weeks after cleanup. So we've brought some of our samples of Timothy back into the office here that we suspect have some Timothy mites. And you can still see the purple ink in the leaves and especially the rolling it looks like drought stress but we were able to get them under a, a lens here and see a little bit better and we were able to identify the small pale mites there in between the leaf veins so it's a pretty positive ID that we've got the mites and we need to get some 7XLR on there to take care of this issue.